You could. <laughs> I don't even know what they're saying right now. First, first. <laughs> Flame glow. That was my nickname in high school. Flea and tick. Probably Should get this that. for Mateo. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. I am visiting family at my hometown in Pennsylvania and I am at the local Dollar General where I've decided to do a challenge where I'm walking in with one dollar and seeing what I can get. And with inflation, I don't have high hopes. So, let's see. Some DG deals. Oh, Dolly. Dolly Parton for twenty dollars. Honestly, she's worth it. But you could. <laughs> I don't even know what they're saying right now. Some home goods. I love some home goods. Ten dollars for this. I mean, a steal. A steal. It's the Dollar General. Some bath salts. Three dollars. Three dollars to rip someone's face off. A kitchen towel for a dollar. Could be something. But why is this one two dollars? You are the eggs to my bacon. It sounds hetero. Ow. Why is everything so expensive? I mean, I know inflation, but my god. Blankets, fifteen dollars. My god. Guess you gotta be a millionaire to shop at the Dollar General now, am I right? Ten dollars to clean up shit? Cheap chintzy one is six twenty-five. What are we doing here? What's this economy? Mini glitter glue sticks for your hot glue gun. You have a hot glue gun? I don't, so I guess that's useless. You know? A bless this kitchen pot holder. I don't know if I'm the clientele for that. I don't think they're blessing me, am I right? I've really got to give it up to Dollar General. They kind of have everything. What if the power went out in New York one day? <laughs> That'd like that baby up. This is fun. LED light switch. Oh my God. Oh my, a toilet seat? You can get a toilet seat at the Dollar General. This is a sizable toilet seat too. You'd have to have a pretty sizable ass for this. And this is a cat unicorn. Do you, would you carry that first? I gotta say I wouldn't. This is a, oh God, $2? No. This is a very large pen. That is very phallic. A coin purse with a sloth riding a llama or alpaca. I don't have the strength to open that. The first verse. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> a very dirty stretch critter? No. <laughs> Do I look gay? Gay. 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 The brief aisle, you know, any gay watching will know. As little boys, this was our favorite aisle. Dollar deals, extra strength gas relief. How many does it come in? 25, that's a deal. That's a deal. Cheesecloth? The hell's a cheesecloth? Is it for your cheese? Hand sanitizers. You can tell COVID's affected everybody because literally just anybody's making hand sanitizer. You have icy grape hand sanitizers <laughs> and Dippin' Dots cookies and cream hand sanitizer. I. I can't say that I want to rub that on my hands. And I don't think I'd feel clean or sanitized after. Some muscle rub. Fast penetrating. Oh my God, this is inappropriate. Daily defense. <laughs> That's the brand. What are you defending yourself from with this? <laughs> if you're a man using three in one, you are defending yourself from even finding a partner. Even these dinosaurs aren't even a dollar. My God, think of the children. Mega stick night glow. Great for parties. 14 inches. That's some kind of party. Well, if you're still living in the early 2000s, 
Dollar General's got some DVDs for you. None of them are for a dollar, but let's see what DVDs they have. A five movie collection for $10? It's a steal. Dune? This is like a new movie. Eight dollars. Eight? Sorry, Timmy, but... Looking like your movie's doing well if you're already eight dollars on the Dollar General. Boarding Gate? I think this one went straight to DVD. Permanent. Never heard of her. American Underdog, no one wins alone. Well, no one wins watching this. Jesus Revolution. I don't know about that one. Escape Room, find the clues or die. I mean, I know it's more than my dollar budget, but some quality shit. These are nice measuring cups. Ones are like... Wait. Pastry mat, baked with love. Mine's always baked with hate. <laughs> Breathe through your mouth. I found the clearance section in Dollar General. So this is the stuff no one wanted. Flea and Tick. Probably should get this for Mateo. <laughs> Urinary Tract Health. $66. Got a UTI? Guess you're peeing fire. Because you're not for than that. A flameless... Can't say the same about me. That's name brand. Yeah. How much is it? $4.80. And I don't like lavender. I said it. Spaghetti? Okay. I could get this for Mateo for a Christmas gift. Holy. Two pounds? You can get a grill? Flame glow? That was my nickname in high school. Under cabinet jar opener. Why are you opening jars under your cabinet? Balloon zoom. Just pump and launch. Done that a few times. <laughs> Froth King? That was my nickname in college. I've scoured the store, and I gotta say, the oddest and most unique item is only for a dollar. And it is this Dippin' Dots cookies and cream hand sanitizer. So I feel like I have to get it, because where else are you gonna find this for a dollar? Well, we did it. I was on a mission to find something for a dollar at the Dollar General, and I didn't think it was going to be that hard, seeing as the word dollar is in the name of the store, but apparently it's harder than you think. But I'm pleased with my purchase, and uh, who knows, maybe I will enjoy having the scent of cookies and cream Dippin' Dots on my hands every day. I've had worse. So thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and give thanks. So until next time. It's chaos right now. Pennsylvania visiting family. Yeah, there's a nice park up the street. Why don't you do that? I know. Well, I'm doing... Pencil... All right, I have found... Someone shit their pants. <laughs>